Hey, art friends! We got a cool drawing from SpongeBob today. What are we gonna draw, dude? Pearl! Pearl! All right, checkers, you ready to drop Pearl? Yeah. <laughs> She's kind of girly, huh? She's kind of—it's yeah. kind of a girl thing, but we thought that this was. She would be a little little hard for Hads to draw, and so Checkers agreed to draw with me, huh? Yeah. <laughs> All right, dude, you ready to draw her? Yeah. Okay, let's do it. All right, first step, we're gonna draw her whole body, and we're gonna draw her with pom-poms. You know what those are? Yeah. Those are the things that cheerleaders hang on to when they go, rah, rah, rah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay, ready? All right, first step, we're gonna draw her head, and it's gonna be a diagonal line that starts Kind of not all the way over and not in the middle of the paper, but a little to the left. And we're going to draw it all the way up. And you want to stop. Yeah, good job. So, and then we're going to just draw a little, a little corner on it, just like a little hook. So it's not a sharp hook. And then we're going to draw another line that comes down. And this is for the top. This is the top of her nose. And she kind of has a square nose, huh? Yeah. Because she's a whale. And then we're going to draw a line down. Good job. That's good. And then we're going to draw a line, a little curved corner, and then a line straight, straight across. And then stop. Yeah, don't make it too far. And then we're going to draw her smile. And I'm going to come a little further, and then her... Smile is going to curve up and then end. So like you're curving to the beginning of the line. There you go. Good job, man. Okay, now let's draw our eye and it's just going to be a big oval. Awesome. Perfect, man. I think Pearl's kind of funny, don't you? Yeah. We're going to draw another oval right there and then color that in. I think she's funny. She cracks me up. <laughs> and we're going to do our eyelashes. So three little lines. You remember when we did SpongeBob? Yeah. We actually forgot his eyelashes on that video. Did you know that? Yeah. Yeah. Some of our art friends told us that we forgot. And I went back and watched it. And I was like, oh my gosh, we forgot the eyelashes. So if you ever do the SpongeBob drawing, just be sure to remember, or remember to add those three little eyelashes on top of his eyes. All right, cool. Ready to keep going? Yeah. Okay, let's do it. All right, so right under right under this, this corner right here, we're going to draw a straight line, and it's going to come almost like to the, to the bottom of her eye or, and also to kind of where we stopped the smile. Good job. And we're going to draw, we're going to leave a little space, and then we're going to draw a line to the corner down here. Good job, dude. And then we're going to do the same thing, leave a little space, and then draw a line that comes across almost to her mouth. Does that look like her nose? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, now draw a curved line right, right up here at the top, and that's for the little blowhole at the top of her head where she blows uh, water out. I don't remember what those are called. Okay. Now, let's draw our lips, and we're going to do a curvy kind of M or like a heart, like the top of a heart. I thought that's like, um, I'm not sure. That's her lipstick. She puts it way out there. <laughs> I think that's what it's supposed to be. <laughs> okay, now let's finish her mouth, and we're going to just draw, we're going to come out of this line right here and then draw a little curved line. Good. And then we're going to finish that line. It's going to come down and make kind of a big... What? Big mouth. She's happy. All right. Okay, now let's draw her tongue. And so we're going to draw another curved line right there in the middle of her mouth. Good. And then we're going to do another one, but it's going to come all the way around. So we're doing almost like an M, but it's going to come all the way around and... And good. And then right here, we just got a little line that would connect the bottom. Does that look like your tongue? Yeah. That's pretty cool, huh? Okay, now let's just put another line right here for the side of her mouth. And let's do her hair. We're going to do a W. 
a job, and then a big U that goes like this. Good. And then we're going to draw kind of a rainbow line here. Good. And then a big sideways rainbow line this way. And that's her hair. Kind of weird looking, huh? Yeah. But she's got it in a ponytail. So let's finish her ponytail. So we'll draw an S line. Good. And then we're going to come around and finish. I'm going off the page, but you would keep going all the way around. Perfect, man. You did it. We're, we're almost done. We got to do our body now, okay? You ready? Yeah. We're going to draw a big line that comes all the way down from her hair, and it's going to come all the way down, and this is going to go into her body. Okay. You want to leave some room down here for her, for her uh, dress and her legs. So come all the way down. You kind of come close to her mouth. Good job. Okay, now this line, we're going to do the other side of her body, and it's going to be kind of the same. It's going to come close to her, to the other line. Good job. Okay, now let's put a contour line right there, the bottom. Good job. And we're going to do another contour line up here. <clears throat> Excuse me. And that's going to be the top of her shirt. Good job. And then let's finish her her lip. And then she's kind of got these straight lines right here. <laughs> awesome. Okay, you ready for her? Uh, let's do let's do her arms. So we're gonna draw a contour line that comes out. Good. And then a curved line back and that's for one of her sleeves and then we're going to draw our arm that's coming out of it okay so we're going to draw two lines that come into her arm her uh, sleeve good good job and then we'll do the same thing over here except let's just do a big round line like that for her other sleeve and we can draw two lines parallel lines but they're kind of curved Coming out of that arm. Good. Should we do her pom-pom? Yeah. This is fun. We're just going to do a little zigzag line, but we're going to make it go around into a circle. <laughs> I like it, man. Doing good. Awesome. Okay, and then let's do the same thing on the other side. And you want them to be about the same size, okay? Okay. fun making zigzag lines, don't you think? Yeah. <laughs> Even though it's kind of girly, pom-pom, mm. <laughs> it's still fun, huh? I like Pearl. All right, good job, man. That's awesome. Look at that, dude. It looks like her, huh? Okay, now let's draw, let's draw her dress. You know what? I'm going to have to extend my paper out because I'm going to kind of run out of room here, but maybe I'll try and fit it in. So we're going to draw two lines that are coming out, and this is for her her uh, cheerleading dress and then we're going to do a wait we're going to do a wavy line that comes down up down up good job okay and we're going to do a little round for the bottom of her dress all right our our camera turned off again we got to get that fixed bro yeah that's annoying <laughs> so what we did was we we finished her dress by drawing, we extended this line and we looped it back around here. And then we extended this line and we looped it around over here to finish her dress, huh? Mm -hmm. Is that pretty cool? The other thing we did is we got a piece of paper because we ran out of room. So we extended it down here so we could finish her legs. Sound good? Yeah. All right, let's keep going, man. We're almost done. All right, okay, we're gonna do two lines that come out of the bottom of her dress. On that side, I'm going to extend a little bit longer 
and then two lines that come out over here and this is because she's jumping up to do a little cheerleading move <laughs> good job dude awesome okay now we're gonna we're gonna do a funny little hook that comes around I'm gonna gotta go back over the paper and that's gonna be for a boot I'm gonna do it on this side too little hook that comes around it's almost like a J and a backwards J good job all right okay now let's finish her boot so we're gonna loop back around and then end it there good and then we're gonna put a little heel on the back of her boot you got it oh. <laughs> it's, the foot looks a little broken, but that's okay. <laughs> we'll practice. <laughs> so let's do the same thing over here for other boot. No, that time I'm getting <laughs> And then we'll do a little heel on the back of her boot. And then we'll do a contour line up here to finish off her boot on both sides. Good. We're missing one thing. What are we missing? Um, a P. Yeah, we're missing the P on her shirt. Okay, so we're going to do a straight line down. Good. And then we'll do a U or a J on its side. And we want it, we don't want to go all the way. Yep. And we'll do a straight line down. Good. And then a line at the bottom. And then we're going to do a D right inside the P. Finish off the P. Awesome, dude, look at that, man. You drew Pearl. <laughs> it was fun. Didn't you have fun? fun? Yeah. Now we can do, we, we've got another character from SpongeBob. Yeah. Yeah. We hope you guys had fun drawing Pearl with us, and we'll see you later, art friends. Goodbye. Bye, art friends. High five. Shut up. Oh. <laughs>